Tonight, champions were crowned in Coralville as the Girls' Day Wrestling Tournament came to a close. Starting the night at 100 pounds, Katie Biscoglia of Raccoon River Northwest was the first ever state champion last year. In the second period, she breaks a 0-0 tie with the takedown. She had some third period assurance and becomes the first ever two-time state champion in Iowa Girls Wrestling. After I won my first state, my first state title, I mean, immediately after, it was like, I can be the first four-timer. I mean, I'm the first two-timer. I can be the first three-timer. I, I can be the first four-timer. And at 110, Jasmine Ludke of Atumwa looking to defend her title. Second period, Ludke up 1-0, gets the takedown, and makes it 3-0, dominating in the third period. Now she closes out and wins an 8-1 decision, an emotional way to close out her senior year as back-to-back -back state champ. I was just so excited for myself and just being able to go back home and say like, yeah, I won again. <laughs> I know everyone at my school is going to text me, so that's amazing. <laughs> On to 130, a unique matchup. Sadell's Colby Tenborg is the 10th seed against the 8th seed. Tenborg up one in the second. She gets the single leg, then gets the takedown, gaining a 5-2 to two edge. Third period now, Tenborg up by six. Musser shoots, but Tenborg counters for two. And Colby Tenborg goes from the 10th seed to number one. Seeding doesn't matter. I saw the seeding and I was like, seeding, there's a 27 seed too. And it doesn't matter, it's just... How hard you're going to put in the work.